What's up guys? In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to set up ExpressVPN on your Windows 11 machine. So you've just installed Windows 11 on your machine and you want to set up ExpressVPN. Maybe you already have an active account and an active subscription or maybe you want to start afresh. I'll be showing you how to do just that. So the first thing you want to do is launch your favorite web browser. I'll just use Microsoft Edge. It's not exactly my favorite browser, but let's use it for now. So what you want to do is go to expressvpn.com or you can do a quick search of expressvpn and then look for the option that has expressvpn.com. Alternatively, I'll leave a link in the description below. So if it's your first time and you've never registered for expressvpn, then you just need to get started. And the best way to get started is by choosing a package. You can choose the 12 month package, the six month package or the one month package. Of course, the six and the 12 month packages come with discounts. And then once you choose, go ahead and enter your email address and then choose a working payment method. And once you do that, you'll be sent an email from where you can verify and now create your ExpressVPN account. If you want to try ExpressVPN for 30 days for free, Use the link I'll leave in the description below. That's my referral link. It will give you 30 days of free VPN service from ExpressVPN. So make sure you go to the description. Use that link to create an ExpressVPN account. Anyway, once you get through that whole process, it will now be time to get into your ExpressVPN account. So go to ExpressVPN and sign into your account. And once you're signed in, you should see the ExpressVPN dashboard looking something like this. And of course, the website will detect that you're using Windows, so it's going to prepare the Windows download. So you can go ahead and click on Download for Windows and then confirm where you want to save your downloaded file. The download complete, navigate to the folder where you downloaded. Here it is, the installer. Double click on it to install ExpressVPN application. At this point, I'll just go ahead and minimize everything else and remain with the installer and wait for ExpressVPN to be installed on my Windows 11 machine. So once the installation is complete, you can now go ahead and click on sign in. And at this point, you'll be required to enter your ExpressVPN activation code. Now you can get this code from the website once you're signed in. As you can see, I'm signed in. This is my dashboard. And at the bottom here, I can see my activation code. So copy the code and then go back to the ExpressVPN tool and then paste that code and then click on continue. And that code will be used to verify whether I have an account and an active subscription. And as you can see, the code has been accepted because I have an active subscription. Now I can choose to launch ExpressVPN on startup or maybe to start it manually. I'll choose launch on startup. Do I want to help improve ExpressVPN? Uh, not really. And now we are ready to launch ExpressVPN and literally change the location of this Windows 11 PC. So this is a power button. This is where you turn the VPN on and off. At the bottom here is where you choose the location. So if you click on these three dots, it should give you another window where you can choose the precise location you want. And ExpressVPN has an extensive collection of locations. You can choose locations in the US. You can choose locations in France, Italy, UK, US, Netherlands, France, whatever you want to be. In fact, if you choose a country like United States, by clicking on that arrow, you can choose different states in US. I'll just go and choose US, for instance. And then I'll close that. And as you can see, New York has been selected. Now, before we turn on the VPN, go to the menu in the top left corner. And as you can see, you have a couple of options you can tweak. Now, you can go and play around with these settings later. But for me, the most important settings are under the general tab. And that's on startup. So first of all, I want to make sure launch Express VPN on Windows startup is checked. And that basically means as soon as I switch on my computer, ExpressVPN will be launched. Also, I want ExpressVPN to connect to the last used location when ExpressVPN is launched. So basically what I'm telling the app 
is as soon as the Windows 11 machine is started, it should launch VPN and automatically connect to the last used location, which is USA. So with those settings configured, click on OK, and then you can now go ahead and turn on your VPN. And there you go. So currently it's connected. We have an active VPN and the Wi-Fi, in fact, the Wi-Fi icon at the bottom of the screen should turn into this uh, sort of a LAN connection icon. And that's how to set up ExpressVPN on your Windows 11 machine. Thanks for watching and good luck.